and now start our the new chapter is laser in the chapter of uh, interference of light we have used the terms coherence between the two source of light the two source are coherent when they vibrate in the same phase jab dono hi same phase mein vibrate karenge so they are coherent or there is a constant phase difference ya dono ke beech mein phase difference constant hona chahiye we know that the light from a source comes as a sum total of radiation by billions and billions of atoms or molecules in the source the phase is different at different time now the question is that to what extent may be the radiation from different atom of a given source be related in phase in direction of emission and polarization that means the coherence of a given source in recent year some sources are developed which are highly coherent to aisa kaun si aisi cheez hai jiske through hum kisi uh, uh, output jo hai coherent mil sakta hai to these coherent source are called laser the word laser stand for light amplification by stimulated emission of radiation to so this is the stands laser l a s e r laser is light amplification by stimulated emission of radiation we know that the interference purpose the two coherent light rays are obtained from a single source of light because two independent source cannot be coherent here we will discuss here the laser what is laser what is the important of laser what is the property of laser how to work laser action and so many point will be discussed later on here laser is a device which produce light waves all exactly in phase thus the interference pattern may be obtained uh, with light beam from two separate laser the first successful laser was ruby laser it was built by american physicist t h menon in 1960 he used ruby crystal to obtain laser beam and laser are used to provide very intense monochromatic collimated and completely coherent light beam the laser work on the principle of stimulated emission to so laser jitne bhi laser hum aage study karne wale hain wo that is the behalf of the stimulated emission and the most important feature of laser are the first is the most important as you know is uh, you can see your screen the first is monochromatic monochromatic mean concentrate in a narrow range of wavelength one specific color this is the monochromaticity and a light from a laser beam is nearly monochromatic while light from ordinary source ki baat karenge to is never monochromatic monochromatic in a single wavelength honi chahiye the light from normal monochromatic source is spread over a wavelength range of 100 iske jo range hoti hai yadi hum direct yadi iske discuss kare range ke bare mein that is a 100 armstrong se leke 1000 armstrong tak ki range ho sakti hai but on the other hand in case of laser the spread is of the order of a few armstrong okay the second thing is coherent this is the second point here all the emitted photons bear a constant phase relationship with each other in both time and phase that is the coherence and a laser beam is completely coherent it is possible to observe interference effect from two independent laser beam and third one an important is unidirectional ho sakte hain ya high directionality a very tight beam which is very strong and concentrated an ordinary source of light radiate light in all direction yadi hum ordinary light ki baat karenge to uske jo molecules spread out hote hain wo charo direction mein hote hain but on the same time when we discuss in laser a laser source emit radiation only in one direction yani ki highly directional hai so these are the three more important feature of laser monochromatic coherent directionality and ek aur bhi hota that is called divergence yani ki kitna 
डाइवर्जेंस हो सकता है तो लेजर बीम डज नॉट डाइवर्ज नहीं हो सकता वो डाइवर्ज द लाइट फ्रॉम कन्वेंशनल सोर स्प्रेड आउट इन द फॉर्म ऑफ स्फेरिकल वेब फ्रंट के रूप में होता है जो हम ऑर्डनरी सोर्स लेते हैं हेंस दे आर हाईली डाइवर्जेंट बट इन द सेम टाइम वेन वी डिस्कस अवर लेजर तो लेजर जो है बहुत कम ही डाइवर्स होता है उसका फॉर्मूला हम डिस्कस करते हैं डेल्टा थीटा इज इक्वल टू वन पॉइंट टू टू लेमडा अपॉन डी तो दिस इज कॉल्ड डाइवर्जेंस दिस इज द अनदर प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ लेजर 